It was an accident. No, Doctor, it was not an accident. A bucket of bolts was too dear. The Savage it. emptied it and deliberately, deliberately aimed it at your head. We saw a figure running from the scene, and I believe it was the same person who mistook Dr Delaney for you the other night. Now, I'm going to ask you the same question I asked about Dr Delaney. Have I made any slip-ups lately? No. And the most exciting thing about my private life is I'm getting married. Yeah, well, perhaps that's at the heart of all this. Who would want to stop us? Someone does. Inspector, I've had a photo of Jim in my handbag, a side pocket. The other day I was in a rush, forgot my bag, came back for it. It was open. I'd never, never leave it unsaid. And the photo was gone? Yes. Right, look, um, if you've got no objections, Mrs. Mostyn, I'd like Dr. Kirkwood to move in with you. And whatsoever. But why? Everybody knows where the doctor lives, including killers. And if they don't, there's a sign outside with your name on it. Yes, and I'll assign a plain clothes officer to you. DC Briars could do that, sir. Hmm. It's very kind of you, but is it really necessary? Doctor, you might not know who, but somebody wants you dead. Hi. Thanks for coming. Uh, a cappuccino, please. Yes, sir. This is about us getting back together, David. I'm sorry. I no, really, no, I no, really... no, no, I promise. This is business. I want you to raise a loan for me on my shop. Sure it is yours? How much? Quarter of a million. No chance. Well, what's Just it? a sec, Pat. You're missing the point. The money would solve my problem, certainly, but wouldn't it solve yours as well? I mean, you do have a problem. At least you've got a reason to be here, Alec. It's supposed to be my day off, and I've been dragged along on a family day out. And look at those two. Can you believe it? 60 years old. I'm in the house with them. I didn't open the door in case of what they're up to. Morning, Clifford. Morning. I hear somebody's been trying to kill you. Apparently, yes. I bet they muffed it and got Delaney instead. No justice in the world, is there? There certainly isn't, or you'd have been locked up long ago. What's he got that I haven't? Good manners, for a start. Hey, stand back, please, sir. Who the hell are you? It's all right, Sergeant. He's one of our members. Police, eh? We have become important. Who is that? Clifford Rawnsley. He's a farmer over at Morton. He's got a bit of a thing for Dell. Keep an eye on him, Alec. <laughs> 